angles. Someone's ready to catch on the pinch as Falcons run away. Wizard gonna pick up the opening kill there onto Jay Lad. It puts even more pressure on the C4s that are from below. The flag is being washed out. We've got Muzi on the IQ. He's able to spot out a lot of the gadgets. We haven't seen anything really come to light with Ferrier's gadget so far. Muzi got caught in it for a brief second earlier, but he's been able to ping out a lot of that utility. We can see one there just above the reading door, but look at this pressure coming in yeah. vertically. Comes, he gets caught out in the Ferrier, but he doesn't care. He's gonna stick the plant anyway. Psycho from above picks up his second Joker. Got a lot of work to do now along with Oakhills, especially seeing as the plant has gone down. Muzi, he's just occupying this space on wide stairs. He's got Psycho below. That's going to give the cue to call and the information. Pino from above, he's going to find one. And Oakhills, well, time. Muzi's got himself into that washroom position. First kill comes through. Cons. He's able to open the wall through into the top of Lumber and immediately take Quibs down. Maybe he should have dropped as Wizard. He's going to pick up another. I mean, Wizard, he's in a great position just to cut off the crosses. If anyone from Falcons tries to maybe get back into the bombsite and assist, it just isn't going to happen. And that's exactly what he's done. So it just leaves a 1v5 for Falcons NIP, Ollie. It's, it's even easier than what it was last time. It shouldn't be like that. Falcons have just allowed NIP to rinse the cycle again. 25 seconds left. Oakills gets a glimpse and a chance. Is able to take down Cons with it. The diffuser maybe finds himself a second here, but he can't watch. It's about dipping back, but instead stays for the challenge. This is what we wanted to see from Falcons. Immediately traded off by Muzi's nade, but Psycho can get aggressive and play right up against that breach now. Not only can he call out where people are, so he now knows the Muzi's going to be swinging into prep. Feeds that information over to Pino. It almost writes itself. We're now seeing Oakhills having to make that rotation back, get himself a little bit close to sight. Quibs can't really. But oh, look at that. The use of the Captain House smoke bolts being able to cover off the vertical angles above allows him to move in. Diffuser is going down from Psycho. But there is still a bit of a fight back. Oakhills has taken down Pino. Glad needs to try and get in there. He needs to try and stop it, but that's not going to happen. Just Monty can sit in the corner now. All the NIP passive as it comes. Can dip outside. Oh, almost. Catches the hedge on to the Nomad, but there's the long angles from Cons. Picks up the double. We are seeing quite a bit of value there out of the Osser. J-Lad is allowed to make a little bit of a reposition there. There's a Femria gadget in this mixture as well, so it's all not ideal, but look at what happens from above. Quibs is able to find one back. This is better from Falcons, but the plant is still going down here. We are going to see a great swing there. The Psycho and Muzi pick up one apiece. NIP, they... They should see more goes out from J-Lad. Isn't going to be successful. Cons able to open up the wall again into the top of White. Quibs, this time, going to find the opening, opening pick, pick for the first time for the Falcons. As Cons is shut down. A lot of his work has been done, though, and he should have put this top four in half. Quibs, location known, easily taken out there by Pino. There were a number of NIP guns looking oh. in that direction. And what a flick from Pino onto J-Lad. He's a job of something of that nature. It's not the air job you need to be worried about. It's the gun. Wizard, he's able to take him out on the Nomad. And Joker, now with a lot of work to do inside of 20 seconds, picks up the first. Wizard still has Diffuser in hand, but Muzi is a little bit deeper. And I'd be certainly taking their time over this one. Pino, he's going to get run out on from below. We finally see some of that aggression, but it isn't going to matter. Two kills instantly responded to. Dude, they're probably wanting to swing in towards the window. That's a yellow ping. They know that Jalad is here with the shotgun. Keep in mind from Legion rips into it, but they both trade. There's the run out from Oakhills, but Wizard has the refrag. He's in the sight, Ollie. Much better there from Falcon. The patience that was shown by Oakhills there on that run out was phenomenal. He's still hanging around the bottom of this reading door. Where's Diffuser? Is it outside? Wasn't it? It was Korn's had it. Is it not outside east? It is outside east, Ollie. This is an issue, because they need Diffuser 15 seconds to go. There's still time here. Oakhill's location is known, but he has got some information of his own. Go He's going to try and stay alive now. There's yeah, only exactly. 10 seconds left. Isn't going to be oh, aware. Sorry, I'm just, I'm getting ahead of myself. But they had the Diffuser outside. They had almost mm. spotted I mean, if we did. Observation, but they're a bit. Coupled with the Mute Jammer. Mm. As they go, it's, it's almost impossible here. Psycho just pops up. He's playing whack-a-mole there. Joker. 
just with it. Cons can see some great timing, but unfortunately, can't land the finishing blow. Pino forced to drop here as Falcons are putting on a bit of a mass down, but he's got a good bit of information. Can he land the first? Yes. Players almost lining up nicely for him there. The plan is reattempted here by J Lab. He's only down to the CZ quick. They're all upstairs. They're not holding us. Remember that specific, you know. Diffling has got to try and catch them off guard. P9. Knows that somebody's there inside of Christmas. Joker gonna be going for this swing now as well. A little bit of a reposition though from Psycho. It's Pino, he's gonna be there to back him up. P9 just gonna try and push his way in and through the side door, but he can't do that if Pino's still knocking around. Oh, look at this. Fantastic, flawless attacking half the solar side. We can see obviously a player in the windows. There's also a guy in the bathroom windows as well. But one little thing that I do like to see from Falcons is they have O kills by himself, who can maybe slip in on the deck to just walk in the piano alley. That could happen. A lot more of a direct approach here. Maybe a little bit of a bait and switch, but he's just too unsure. Can't decide which way to turn. Quibs, he's left as the last alive. 14 seconds left on the clock. And with the wall not even open into sight, barbed wire greeting his passage. Really slipped. Uh, I mean, is the swing gonna come in? Ooh, Shaman takes a bit of damage. The smoke just to try and give Kons a bit of leeway. Maybe tries to push back, and Nay's gonna get tossed in behind him. Kons has spread forward, a great swing. Brilliant from Falcons, pushes him forward. Great swing from Jalad. NIP, lose a pick and lose another one. P9 will jump on top of that, but a down comes in. A great pick from Pino, just to slow down the tempo of Falcons now, because they need to get that revive. Still a lot to do here for both teams to be successful. Joker, he's going to push himself down. Blue picks up the first, logs on to the second. There's a huge amount of damage, but not the finishing blow. Pino, he's left with only a sliver of HP. He's going to go and confirm his kill, because we know that kills are important in this tournament. The flank goes down from Joker being finished off inside. Slowly dipping themselves back, but Joker Ooh, could be in a great position to play backstab, but just get called oh! out on the proxy. No, walks backwards into the frost mat. Oh, why is it there? What's going on there? What's Pino doing outside a trench? It's Christmas. And the best ones. Freebie picked up there. Oh, kills. Has an option to try and recover this diffuser. He's actually going to need it. Up against this three versus five. P9, seeing if you can find anything, but just gets caught out on the wide swing. Just feels a little bit lazy there from Falcons. You've still got a little bit of information at the fingertips here. You've got the Iyana, you've got the clone, you've got a couple of drones knocking about with only 20 seconds left on the clock. Quibbs trying to find something on the swing, but look at how oppressive this clash can be. His teammates don't even need to peek. Pino's gonna single-handedly lock this round in for his team. Okills puts a couple of cursory shots here and there, but this round is all but done. Ten points might be low, but that is never gonna be enough. They will open up the office wall, open up one side of it. These guys cannot get away from it. He's took a bit of damage from the Thorn Trap P9, so he has from the Razor Bloom. Pino, opening kill again goes in favor of NIP. Yeah. They so say, I'm going to bait Look you, where Pino so you confirm is. the kill. Pino doesn't need to bait yeah. anything, he's just hiding out at the bottom of the stairs. Maybe finds himself a second, no, Joker! He's gonna strike for first blood here in the final 15 seconds for Falcons. O'Kills gets himself into an engagement but loses out to Psycho and Wizard. There hasn't been really any issues today that you can... One big issue that I'm seeing from Falcons is how are they gonna get rid of the Kide Claw on the kitchen wall? or the dining wall, that's what they're running into, Ollie. And because I think they know that, that's where they're trying to go above. This is the issue for them. They don't actually have a, a feasible way because they've dropped all their nades for this push, Ollie. They've no nade presence. Muzi and Cons find one apiece. Muzi taking advantage there of the Fenrir trap. Psycho He's gonna put Quibs into that one versus four. Quibs location no now, it's only a matter of time. Muzi, a little bit of an ego challenge there, but you can't really blame him for it with 35 seconds left and a lot of kills to find. Quibs, this is in a bit of a tough situation now. Is there a frost mat on the window? Do you risk it on the hop in or do you just try and bait and find one from outside? The with only 15 seconds and no diffuser, it's not looking too good. Pino, he's gonna be the next player to fall. And as if on cue, you can see the players scurrying down, getting themselves out of dodge. Nicely dodged the frost mat but we know that that is not gonna cut it. Be it. just wanna win, don't they? They just wanna win. I mean, sure, we, we kinda talked about, oh, maybe everyone's playing for the kill record. Ash. Even moments like this, it's just NIP, they know Ooh. everything. This is scary how much they know. Who's told them what? Yeah, 
play a little bit further back. You know, you've got your teammate here ready to peek if needed. We've got some support from below as well. That was going to be a nave attempted. We're going to see the shield dropped and spun around, but J-Lad, he's better. Wizard, he isn't ready for the challenge from him, though, and that's going to be the Fuser cold on the ground. Four versus two now. The breach might be open, but the Diffuser is in a horrible position to try and recover. Joker and Quibs, they need to try and buddy up a little bit here, but... Not really greeted with many options, especially Look with the wizards. limited time that is remaining. Wizard, he can sit directly on top of that. He had there in the late game. That's really strong as well. Oh, I'm just going to go straight into the solar, see what I can do. Moment. Muzi finds the opening pick again. Falcons. What's the conversion rate? It's only just the one in my mind. How many rounds have we played? We had eight. This is round seven. It's, it's a tricky one. NIP just looks so prepared. You know, they're trying to get aggressive, which we were begging oh, for, but good. Ollie, NIP, I'm telling you, they have a cheat book. They know everything. Everything. They know Falcon's next step before Falcons know it. Quibs and Joker, you've got to try and hold on now for a minute, and you've got a lot of heavy gunfights coming in your way. Oh. Taken oh. out by Pino. Joker, he makes his way down these main stairs. Cons, gonna start to get that plan down. He's got a little bit of information to work with, doesn't quite get the head. I will say that I, I think Falcon for like a year deal of opening kills here for NIP. Ooh. That's a good kill to get back from Joker. Now he, he can maybe cause some issues above because we know NIP, they like to man mark everyone, don't yeah. they? And, they? and whenever they have the opening pick and they have that free man, that's where the chaos starts to ensue. Oh, they've lost two now. A Shalad will find Pino. That was a quick swing from Pino. Probably trying to get a kill back. Playing quite relaxed here. They've dug themselves in. They don't need to give themselves away too much. And don't forget about that hatch and that roaming player. P9 going to find one onto Psycho. j -Lad doubles down. Comes oh, dear. plant. Cons finds himself too. Ten seconds left. He's got no HP Dead. to speak yeah, of. He's going to have yeah. to try and get it down. But it's... I said before, this is not the finished article. Yeah, if you've got the solace, you need to have someone there ready with the C4 in hand to do something about oh, it. Really? Quips, Quips, fantastic play there, Boozy. Often teams all the players will bait out, they'll throw the nade and then not immediately yeah. jump into the camera. Well, that was really could find himself a couple Take of one. kills here if he picks his moment right, but he doesn't know which way to turn. Flora's drone comes in as Joker is successful on to Wizard. Psycho with the backstab Bray, though, trade one for one. Joker has played this round fantastically, can immediately dip himself down. And don't really have a good option here, and yeah, drops in. O kills goes on check. Cons will try and go for the refrag. Oh, misses out on that kill. Any more coming? There will be a down onto one. Swings through. Oh, P9. And that comes through. Yeah. Cons got a little bit unlucky there, I think. Still going to be putting a bit of pressure here onto the office balcony. Going to be trying to remove that mozzie pest. And Wizard, he sees success elsewhere. Opening kill onto O kills. A lot later on into the round than we've seen previously. 2v3, NIP will take the lead. It's up to Joker. It's up to P9 to keep their team in the series. Showcased again there with Quibbs. He was struggling with the ammo count there and did get a little bit unfortunate. Wizard is going to be holding on to the bottom of the stairs, but P9 goes for some aggression. Love he's it. able to take Muzi down and maybe even retake this top mirror floor. Wizard, he's him. got a mirror window to work with, but he does need to be cautious. Oh. Oryx is caught in the sprint. Three kills. Can Just he man. make it? Four. P9, the only player left alive. Con's going to start to try and go for this plant. Wizard, a quad kill would see it done. Puts the damage in. The pre fire no. comes out, but it isn't going to work. On the other side, does have plenty of time to work with, and it is going to work for him. P9, does he have the metal to stick it? Con's, you've got to aggress. You've got to. Now you understand. Now I understand. <laughs> well, it was the mirror that was downstairs, wasn't it? So